she, she threatened him. Okay. Okay. Get the same opinion. She said, "I'll get you next time." Is that not a threat? No. That's not a threat. I'll get you next time is not a threat. When has that never, ever been not a threat? I'm going to get you next time. Okay. That's not a threat. You're going to stand there in uniform and tell me. I just told you no. So stop asking me the same question over and over again. We've been there. Well, who's your supervisor? Because I'm supervisor going up the chain of command. Lieutenant Philly. Lieutenant Philly. Hey, he's out in the field. You want to talk to him? Yes, I do. Okay, I'll call him over here. Okay. And he's going to tell you the same thing I told you. What? Okay. What's he going to tell me? The same thing I just told you. I just said that. Why do I got to repeat myself to you? I don't know. Why do you got to repeat so yourself? You get it through your head. How many times do I have to repeat to you that that he, your officer, broke the Constitution, violated the Constitution, threatened an elderly citizen out here? And you just told me that it's bullshit. That's completely inappropriate. I mean, I'm paying taxes for officers to come over here, threaten the elderly, harass them. The man is drinking a non-alcoholic beverage. She had no right to continue to harass him when she found that out. What's your name? Steve. Steve. I'm just an officer. I'm not above him. What are you trying? What are you trying to do right now? What do you want? Um, I'm standing up for people who are being harassed by the law. Okay. Um, what are you trying to get resolved out of this right now? Well, um, I would like to see officers not abuse their do privileges. Do you want an apology from that officer? Or what right now do you want? No, I would like, I would like to file a complaint. Which you just did with him. No, I didn't file a complaint. I talked to him, and he basically wouldn't listen to anything I had to say. So. I know, and you didn't get what you... I would like to see um, our senior citizens not be harassed. Okay, this this is supposed to be a free country. I know it. I we know have it. the U.S. Constitution. Totally Every time I turn around, I see another video on the internet from someone being uh, I hear you. I hear you. I abused hear you. by the law. Just as frustrated as you are right sure. now. What, what more do you want from him? I'm I'm hearing you. Trust me. <laughs> What more can we do for you? Democracy, freedom. Can't do you that know? For you. Can't do that for well, you. What well, you got. You guys could do your we, part. We're trying. What I mean, can you. We do you could. You could. Uh, you know. Right at this moment, what can we do for you? <laughs> what can? You, well, you can. Besides you can. You can tell. You can tell your other officers to stop violating the law while they're trying to enforce it. But right at this moment, what can I and we do for you, and what can he do more? For Abide you? by the Constitution. Outside I mean, that's, that. that's, I'm not asking a whole lot. Besides I mean, I came over, I, look, look, I came over here, and this woman, this woman is, is belittling and standing over Steve. with an aggressive stance over an elderly man who's probably homeless. I heard all that, but besides all that frustration and going and rehashing the whole story and everything, what can we do for you? I can't resolve that situation. I can't resolve what just happened. I can't resolve what you just went through, but what can we do right now? I hear you. I'm not here ten hours a day. I hear you. I, know I, I think that officer should be suspended. Did that answer me? Yeah, I, I, you, I. You and I both know that isn't going to happen. Yeah, I'm pretty. I, I'm pretty sure that that's not going to happen. I just can't change what he just told you. I just can't change any of that. So, so, what I don't understand is you seem you seem like you're on the up and up, and that you actually want to support and defend the Constitution of the United States of America, like I swore to when I joined the service. Um, However, there are other officers out here who are abusing their power. Steve, you want to talk to his supervisor? Do you still want to do that right now? I can't resolve any of this for you. Why? Right why are you guys? Why are you guys trying to protect her so much? I don't understand that. You have an officer Steve, who's Steve. acting inappropriately, and you guys are all coming to bat for her. Steve, do you still want to talk to his supervisor? Yes. Okay. We'll see what we can do for you, sir.